Okay, for the 100% LHR unlock uh, miners I've been using, I have been having stability issues with all my 3080 Ti's Asus brand. I've even split one or two across multiple rigs just to make sure it wasn't the OS and stuff like that. Done a lot of uh, disk checking, memory checking on the uh, Windows systems. Even ran Hive OS with Linux and had issues. So that led me to believe there's got to be something with the with the cards and or the um, memory overclocks. And I figured I was getting 120 mega hash. I just want to get that sweet 120 mega hash. So I maxed out as much as I could without crashing the cards. And I was happy, but they run for four or five hours. And then I'd either get a memory management error with uh, G minor. T-Rex minor would give me a uh, uh, TDR nvidia kernel panic error crashing windows and uh, mb minor would crash as well on similar blue screen of death errors on windows so what i did i made a stable and a high version of my uh, g minor i like g minor it's been giving me the best results and i i went through and just started to tweak down the m clock i use a lock core clock and that seems to uh, not really be the issue so i put that at 1200 and i slowly uh, tweaked it down and uh, this uh, version right here I got 116.51 mega hash on ETH hash mining two miners getting paid out of Bitcoin and it's been running for over a day so I think it was the mem clock setting I'm not going to be able to squeeze out 120 mega hash on these cards and be stable it's just the luck of the draw you get what you get I'm a little turked about it but I'm still getting more than 93 mega hash which is what I was getting over a week ago so I'm happy with this I need stable and Hive OS didn't do it for me either. So I am going to stick with Windows and uh, and go with that. So here you're looking at the high version. This is where I get 120 mega hash, but it only run for like two to four hours before there's like a memory leak or the card turns out causing Windows to crash and or Hive OS will actually uh, just go down. The Linux will actually go down. So it's not just a Linux or Windows issue. It's the card. You got to make sure you don't overtax them with the M clock setting. And that is, in my case, that is what the problem was because it's been stable. The high version is not stable, but I want to get as much as I can out of it when it's running. But at night or so, I'll probably put back to the stable version. Makes sense? Okay. Hope this helps somebody. Check your overclocks. I'm out.